You've been unhappy for a while, but does that mean it's time to break up with someone you love? I'm Greg, and I'm here today to help you find an answer to this difficult question. If this video helps you, please be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. One question you can ask yourself is if the relationship is really draining. It feels like you need to put more energy into it daily and you don't feel any happier. You might have an overwhelming feeling of stress and anxiety, but you can't identify the source. It just might be your relationship. Another telltale sign is if it feels like you're growing in different directions. This sometimes happens if you get together when you're young or when you hit a point in life with lots of changes, like when the kids move out. Your life can change quickly during those times and you may find yourself drifting in different directions. Last but not least, if your intuition is telling you it's over, listen. Your gut senses things that you might not want to see and it knows before you are ready to accept the truth. So that covers whether it's time to break up, but how can you do this with the least hurt possible? One, know for sure that it's what you want to do. Two, find a quiet and calm environment and not in public. Three, be honest while being kind. Four, respect what his feelings are when you tell him. And five, look forward to your future. In the article linked below, I have some great communication tips to use for this particular conversation, as well as how to maintain self-respect during this trying time. This article also has other information you'll find useful, like how to avoid common mistakes and deal with the loneliness you may experience after the breakup. 